what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Malt. So happy to be here with you guys today. We are playing some more Balloons Tower Defense Battles. I'm playing with Fans, the Dark Clasher. Uh, we are playing with him. Hopefully he's going to go late game. I'm not, too uh, I'm not too sure if he's going to. I'm hoping that he will. Um, we're going to roll with Super Monkeys, Subs, Ninjas, and let's see what our bonus is. Hey, I didn't really use the village that much, so let's do that. Let's throw the village in here and uh, see how we can do. Oh, excuse me. Um, so... He looks like he's played a lot of games. He's got a really, really good win-loss ratio. Um, so hopefully he goes late game and doesn't try to rush me or something like that. So um, we are going to start. Uh, we're about to start it up. I play on this map whenever I want to go real late game with somebody just because uh, it's a lot of fun. This map works really, really good. If you guys want to go late game with your friends, make sure that you're playing on this map because it's one of the best ones. You can fit five subs in here. You can fit five Buccaneers if you want Buccaneers. Uh, whatever it may be, so this is the map to go on. This is the map uh, that is just epic. So I'm going to wait and get my air burst starts right there, and then now we're going to start farming eco as well. I'm pretty sure he should be able to defend it with that cannon. I don't want to overrun him or anything like that. Um, if he is a, a true fan, which I'm pretty sure he is, uh, then he's going to know uh, that I want to go late game most likely. So that is what we're going to plan on doing. Um, and hopefully uh, hopefully we can go late game and we can knock it out. He's going to roll with cannons late game, which is interesting. I don't know if I've ever used the cannons late game. Um, but we will see how it goes right here. And hopefully everything works out. He's holding off actually really well with the cannon over there with the cluster bombs and everything. Um, so we're just going to keep on building up our eco uh, as long as we can defend. I'm not expecting him, obviously, to send anything or anything like that. So right now we're just defending against the game, and our airburst starts are going to do a mighty fine job of that. Um, <laughs> uh, so we're just going to continue rolling here and um, <clears throat> see how we go. I think that we're going to do fine. Um... Again, I don't know how good cannons are late game. I think that they're okay, but I'm not too sure about that, obviously. Uh, let's go ahead and get advanced intel on uh, this guy. Come on. Actually, I want to throw a ninja up there towards the top. Or should I build another sub? I don't know. Let's throw a ninja right up here uh, in this top corner and then just continue rolling from here. Obviously, he's not going to do that much. Uh, he's just going to be hanging out. I'm going to use him for advanced intel in a little bit so that we can see camo and any sort of... Uh, camo balloons that um, come out. So we have him. We aren't. We don't need any lead protection right now or anything like that. So we're doing fine. Just want to continue building up our eco right here. Um, and why? Hmm. That's weird. I wonder why the sub wasn't shooting first right there. That was odd. Um, <clears throat> so he's gonna probably need to build something else relatively soon. Here come all the yellows. I'm gonna go ahead and get advanced intel on that. It's only gonna make him shoot a little bit further, as you can see, but he will be able to shoot all the way up to uh, the very top. So we're just gonna send him in little bursts. We're gonna send the yellows in little bursts. How is he losing balloons? Yeah, so we gotta slow down here a little bit because I don't want him to lose too much. Um, same with us. Whoop! We're gonna throw a spike down here, and you know, what? let's go ahead. Let's get a ninja down here as well, just to help out. And I'm actually gonna build one more, uh, one more sub right here, and get twin and barb darts on that, and then we're gonna continue building up our eco. Not too much because again, I don't want to overrun him. Um, the cannon. Oof! I just don't know how well it's gonna do against uh, big crowds, even though it does have the AOE or the area of effect. Uh, where it, it has uh, cluster bomb and everything. Um, we're going to get barbed darts again on that one. And here comes the first camo, but it's okay because we can see camo right now. We can't pop lead right now, which is fine because, again, he's not going to be sending anything because he knows that we're trying to go late game here. Um, so a couple went by on his side. None have gone by on our side. We're doing fine, uh, and we should continue doing fine. I'm not really worried about anything at this point. Um, I do want to get a... Um, a reactor sub fairly soon, but we're going to try and get our eco up to about a thousand before we do that. We're holding off well. He's actually holding off pretty well with how much I'm sending, so I'm not sending too much to him. Um, but we are going to try to, like I said, get our eco up to, um, I don't know, we can probably get to a thousand by about round 16 if, if he holds off well and, and we don't feel like we're overpowering him. I'm not too sure how cannons and wizards are going to do going late game, honestly. 
Uh, it's a little worrisome, but we'll see what happens here. He does have. I, I don't know why he chose those. Um, why he chose those towers? Um, I would think that he would go after some kind. I don't know if he has a boat or not, but subs are like still one of the best towers in the game, in my opinion. Um, he's able to hold off really, really well now, so we're just going to continue spamming, try and get up to 1,000, and then get ourselves some upgrades rolling here. Uh, get up to 1,000. Come on. We're almost to 1,000. Almost to 1,000 here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I want it. I don't know why. I just I like. I love seeing even numbers. I love seeing 1,000 or like 1,500 or something like that. So we're going to get up to 1,000 right there, and now we're going to build the rest of our subs. We're going to go one. We're going to build all three of them right now just so that later on we don't uh, mess up or anything. Get in there. I know you'll fit. There we go. And then get this last sub in here as well right there, and then we're going to build this one up to uh, submerge and then to reactor sub, and that should help us out a good bit. Ooh, yeah, we definitely need it. It's going to help us out a lot as the rest of these balloons start coming in. Come on, give me that reactor. Thank you. And we're going to go barbed darts over here and barbed darts over there, and now we're going to continue sending our eco. So round 27 is the next one that we really have to worry about because we've got lead popping power. We've got everything we need. Uh, we've got the lead popping power with the reactor sub for anybody who's new and doesn't really play too much. Um, some people have been asking questions and I'm just going to slowly go over because since this is probably going to be a late game, I've got time to talk about a lot. So someone asked what regrow is. Uh, regrow balloons or regen balloons down in the bottom right um, are balloons that if they're popped, uh, one layer pops, and if they're not popped again within a couple of seconds, then they go back to the layer that they were at. So um, it works really, really well with rushes and anything, and anything like that. Uh, but they're really, really dangerous against certain classes. Like, right now you can see he has that Tornado Wizard down there. If that Tornado Wizard uh, ran into some regen balloons, he'd be in trouble because it would push them away, and they'd regenerate and come back uh, pretty much just where they were. So if he's not boosted, a Tornado Wizard against Regrow is very, very dangerous. Um, so we're going to go ahead, get Air Burst, Advanced Intel on all of these. Advanced Intel, Air Burst. We're doing good. We are. Do I am definitely happy with how much eco we have at this point. Um, I'm not going to build a super monkey for a little bit. I'm going to try and get up to probably like 3,000 eco or so um, by round 25, if at all possible. That's going to be our goal right here. Um, and we'll see what happens. We'll see if, if, if it does, in fact, happen and if it's possible. Nice. So he's got that balloon impact on that cannon over there, which is epic. Balloon impact is so good. Um, we've still only seen two of his towers, which is interesting. I'm not sure what the other ones are, obviously, because we haven't seen them. Um, I do want to go ahead and get ballistic missiles on some of these. We're going to go strong and uh, strong on this guy. Come on, ballistic missile. There we go. And just continue building up our eco. Now, we don't have flash bomb or anything yet. What the heck am I doing? I'm not paying attention. I'm getting greedy with all the eco. I'm getting very, very greedy with the eco. But if we can get to 2,000 by round I said 3,000 by round 25. That's a little ambitious. If we can get to 3,000, if we can get 2,000 by round 25, um, and start upgrading, then I'm gonna feel a lot better with some stuff. So let's go ahead, get up to 2,000 right there. Get this guy up to um, flash bomb, and uh, then after that, we will be able to um, we'll be able to get him up to distraction. Uh, guys, here's here's one thing for y'all. Please don't. Uh, for those of you you can see right now. Like, those things up at the top are getting annoying. They're really distracting. Please don't um, invite me to play. Uh, if you're on my friends list and I see you online, then I will invite you to play, okay? So that's how it works. If you guys want to respect me in that, I'd really appreciate it because it does mess up recordings, uh, and it can get actually pretty frustrating whenever I'm trying to record, whether it's Clash or whether it's Balloons, and, uh, and people are doing that. So if you could do that, I would really, really appreciate it. That would be epic. I love you all very much. You know that. Um, so we're going to probably throw um, some villages over on the left side with our super monkeys. Um, and I think that, like, let's, we'll probably put a village right here. And then I'm pretty sure I can fit a super monkey behind that. So, uh, also, I want to show y'all what Max Villages looks like because they look pretty ridiculous. They look like the freaking Eye of Sauron from Lord of the Rings. I think that's what it's called. Um, Sauron is what it is, I think. Um, so yeah, we're going to show you all that as well. Let's go and, all right, so here we go. Please tell me he fits behind it. Oh, come on. Look at that. I can see grass on either side of him. Don't tell me that he doesn't fit. That's annoying. Um, all right. So super monkey right there. 
laser and super range epic range and we are not going to go with the sun gods on this one we're going to go with the robo monkeys and hold off with them uh, because they're going to be pretty epic i can't this guy's just crushing wizards there he goes with an ice tower that's interesting uh <laughs> Yeah, that is interesting going with the ice tower, but ice towers actually do work fairly well uh, towards the end of of the game um, with slowing down balloons and, and things of that sort. So he built it around 27 because he knows what he's doing and he knows that Moabs are going to be coming out. So those are actually going to help him out a lot. So we've got 3,000 eco by round 27, guys, which is pretty epic. I'm definitely, definitely okay with that for sure. Um, I'm going to get Sabotage Supply Line now on both of these just to keep and, and have just in case we need it. But obviously, I don't think we're going to need it too much. I love this map because the balloons stay on this map for so long. That's why it's seriously the... I think this is the best map for late game in the game, without a doubt. So again, if you guys are playing with your friends or challenging them, um, this map is, is perfect to go late game on. Um, we're just going to continue building up our eco. Shoot, we could get to 4,000 by round 30, and that would be epic because right now our subs are holding off. Our subs are doing a good job for us. He isn't building eco anymore, which is a little worrisome because he's not going to be able to upgrade too much uh, in the near future. So we're going for it, guys. We're going to see if we can get that if we can get that 4,000 by round 30. That would be epic. I'm going to take a quick drink of water. Keep my throat going. Keep my throat feeling good. Um... And I might be getting a little bit greedy here because we're getting a lot of stuff coming in. Is this guy on strong? No, he's not. So we're going to put him on strong. Uh, we are going to go ahead and build up some Bloon Jitsu Ninjas just for some good uh, popping power underneath it all. So let's put up a couple of Bloon Jitsu Ninjas here and get them rolling. And then we might build uh, this whole little side over here, just Bloon Jitsu Ninjas uh, crushing it along this little uh, pathway as they rotate around. So get a couple of those. Keep on building our eco up now. Uh, we're almost at 4,000. I took a little break, round 30. Uh, I wanted it by round 30, but I needed to have these Bloom Jitsu Ninjas. We're going to use the Sabotage Supply Line right here just to slow it down a little bit, um, and we should be perfectly fine at popping everything. So we're almost at 4,000 eco, guys, at round 31. That's pretty epic. This is... This is turning. It's looking like it's going to be a good round. Um, obviously, round 40 is the one that we need to worry about with uh, all the regrows that come out. So we're going to need a lot of balloon jitsus to do work on that. Um, round 32 is when the first BFBs come out. We've got a sabotage supply line, so I'm not too worried about it. We'll be able to slow them down. So I'm going to go and get up to 4,500 eco right here, and then as you know, we're going to build eco until we see them start coming up. Uh, woo! Looking like some of those balloons are getting fairly far. So let's uh, let's just be safe here because I don't want to get too greedy. Like I've told y'all before, if you get too greedy with the eco, uh, it can be pretty bad for you, and uh, it can really really end up biting you in the butt because you're you're like, yes, I'm making so much money, nothing's happening, but then you get in trouble and uh, BFBs and and regrows and camo leads and all this kind of crap come out and you're not ready for it so you always got to be ready you got to be prepared build up your defense and then build up your eco uh as well so we've got a whole bunch of balloon jitsu ninjas over here now there we go with someone else inviting um can we fit one right there no we cannot there we go with someone else inviting thank you very much um and oh my goodness please stop uh all right so we're gonna get another balloon oh my goodness see guys that's what i'm talking about these guys are being extremely rude right now uh, just by spamming me like oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Yep after this I'm gonna go unfriend that person for doing that um, And sabotage supply line there we go, and let's get another balloon jitsu ninja right in here Everything up at the top is being blocked by this guy who isn't uh, respectful So we're holding off really well. We got our sabotage supply lines. We got our freaking uh, our freaking flash bombs rolling and everything. It shows that I'm in a battle, guys. It shows that I'm in a battle, and he's still inviting me. That's, I don't know. I, that just seems a little bit rude to me, but that's fine. No big deal. Um, so we're going to try and get up to 5,000 eco right here, and then we're just going to crush. We're going to build up a whole bunch of super monkeys, and then I wouldn't mind getting like to 10,000 or even 15,000 uh, in this video for you guys because that could be pretty epic. Let's go and up upgrade this monkey fort. Radar scanner, monkey town, nice. So now that we have the monkey town, every balloon that we get, you can see, is going 4.3. So we're going to get gnarly amounts of eco for all this. It's going to be crazy. Let's throw another super monkey right here. Laser blast, plasma, super range, 
epic range and then continue uh, spamming our eco. Actually, now that we're making that much, I might send blacks and get 7.2 because look at that. It's going to... Ooh, actually, they don't come out as fast, so we're going to stick with pinks. Um, some people send blacks, some people send pinks. It, it really doesn't uh, matter. Pinks do come out a lot faster. Like, watch this. We're going to have it full and one, two. So they were done in two. We fill this up, and it's one, two, three. So you can see the difference right there. Over time, pinks end up uh, helping you out a little bit more. So let's get the Robo Monkey over here as well. Keep on rolling with this. We're holding off super, super good. No problems whatsoever. We've got four sabotage supply lines. That's... That's pretty close to being enough. That's pretty close to being all that we need when it comes to sabotage supply line. Um, here comes more BFBs. We're going to go ahead and use one since we've got a whole bunch. Now he's sending an eco. Good job, buddy. Uh, so he's building up his eco as well. Uh, we still haven't seen... Oh, no, we have seen what his third tower is. We haven't seen what his fourth tower is. So I am a little bit interested to find out what that is. I'm going to do super monkeys up top. Uh, right up here. We're going to do the... Oh, no. Oh, no. Low battery. That's not good. We got to plug this thing in ASAP. <laughs> All right, so that's plugged in. And we're going to go with the Sun God up here uh, just because I don't, I like to know where my abilities are. So the Bionic Terrors have an ability. If you know where it is, then you can use it appropriately. But if I have random Robo Monkeys all over, uh, all over the map, then you're going to run into trouble because uh, you're going to use the ability and it's not going to affect the stuff that you really want it to affect. So you know what I'm saying if you guys have played for a little bit. You got to be wary of where your abilities are on the map. Nice. He's got super monkeys too. Dope. So he's got super monkeys. He's going to be rolling with those. We're going to fill all this up by round 44 with Bloon Jitsu Ninjas uh, just to help out with all of the regrows or regens that are going to... You guys, you guys were complaining so much about me calling it regen. Uh, and now I call it regrow and it makes me mad because it's not regrow. If you look in the bottom of the screen, it freaking says regen right down there. Somebody commented, it was funny, it was like, no more, it's actually regrow because in the original version, uh, it said that it was regrow. Okay, well then why didn't they bring that over? Like in the bottom right, it says regen, so that's what I'm going to call it. I'm calling it regen because you know what, that's what it is. That's what they named it in this game, so that's what it is. Um... Keep on rolling here. Let's get another uh, Sun God monkey up here. One, two, three. Look at that. We've got a lot of money rolling. I'm going to I'm gonna use Sabotage Supply Line, and I'm going to roll out with the Eco right now. Like I'm just going to crush it through round 40. We've got a lot of damage on the board. I'm not worried about anything. I'm probably going to sell my Reactor Sub in a little bit, even though it does help out against the balloons that are underneath it all. Um, I kind of wish that this guy had a Ninja just to just to help slow down with the sabotage supply line because it helps so much. But sadly, he does not. Um, it, oops, excuse me. It could be the end of round 40 when everything comes out. Let's let's get a uh, first strike ability. I'm going to sell this reactor sub. Oh, no, is he going down? Oh, gosh, they're getting kind of far on his side. That's a little worrisome. Uh, upgrade this guy all the way over to first strike ability. Epic. And uh, we're holding off. So he's got a sun god down there now. I don't know how much eco he has, but... I don't think it's as much as me. We're just going to use this first strike ability. Take everything out. Clear it out. Round 40, what's up? That round 40 wasn't bad at all. Sometimes round 40s are like miserable. They're super terrible. Uh, and they're really, really hard to uh, control. But we handled that one well. He handled it well, which is surprising uh, with Wizards. But we'll see what happens here. Again, he doesn't have anything to slow down, guys, which is really, really scary. Oh, nice. He's got the Bionic Terrors. That's what he was saving up for over there. We've got 30,000. Let's go ahead and get... Oh, technolo technological terror. I don't know why I was calling them bionic terrors. Um, let's see if we can fit one more sun god up in here. Can I click on it without touching my battle energy? Nice, I can. Um, one, two, and we're just going to hold out. Get that sun god right there. I'm not going to get the temples up there. Uh, I might get a temple down in the bottom right, though, just because that could be kind of cool. That costs 100000 as you guys know. Um, but I do want to... I want to max this guy out so you can see an energy beacon. Look at this. It starts... It shoots out a little energy beam uh, up there, and it looks pretty freaking crazy. So that's pretty cool. I definitely like watching that thing go. Um, but we're just going to... Continue building up our ego right now. He went with the Sun God. Oh my goodness. I don't know how it's going to do. I've seen Sun Gods used before. That thing consumed so much, guys, and it's not doing that much damage right now. I'm worried. I am definitely worried right now for him. Oh gosh, I'm worried. I'm worried. <laughs> I don't think that was the right decision. I don't think the Sun God was the right decision, guys. I'm. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> We're going to put our sun god right down here, and we're going to build um, 
uh, are we gonna build anything around it? Let's just let's build a nin another ninja around it, and we're gonna go uh, one, two, three, and we're just going to go straight up to it. You got to be careful when you're upgrading it. You don't want to end up using um, increasing its range before you upgrade to Sun God because then it sucks in all your other towers. And uh, it can be it can be a little bit of a problem for you if you know what I'm saying. So let's use another sabotage supply line there. And I'm probably just going to keep on spamming eco honestly until I get up to that hundred thousand that I need because then we're going to be sitting real pretty. We're going to be sitting real real pretty guys over here um, on the board. And I'm trying to think of what else I want to do long term in this because now I feel a little bit better about him that he has uh, that he has. Super monkeys because they really do help out a lot. Let's just use the first strike ability right there. Take those things out. Um, and look at this. We're getting it, guys. We are about to hit that 100,000 really, really soon. 89,000 right there. Still rolling with it. Uh, he's building. There he goes. Now he's building up a whole bunch of other things. He's not sending eco anymore. Come on, buddy. You can you can send. E this is a perfect time to send eco. I know he's building defenses, which is good. But there we go. So we got it. We're going to upgrade this guy. Do it! Yes. All right, dope. So he's sitting right down there in the corner. And can I build another one, like, right here? How epic would that be? I think they consume each other, don't they? I'm pretty sure that they consume each other. So that's the one thing that is a little bit worrisome. Now we're going to go super range and epic range. And he's going to hold off uh, everything once it starts getting into the center. You can see him shooting right there, doing work. Doing absolute work. Let's upgrade this technological terror. And we're just going to keep on going with the eco guys because we're holding off really, really well right here. Use another sabotage supply line. And uh, you can see, watch watch what the, the village does. So it's going to start shooting out a laser. Where is it? It's not in range yet. Maybe it only shoots it on balloons. Is that what it is? No, they just aren't in range of it. Um, <clears throat> so 10,000 eco right there, round 48. That's epic. That's freaking clutch. Let's upgrade a couple more of these to first strike ability without an issue whatsoever. Watch this. We're going down. Boom. Look at all those first strike abilities we just got without a problem. We're going to go one, two, and we're going to pop everything. Two of those guys takes out a ZOMG without a problem whatsoever. Um, we've got all of our ninja monkeys. We've got a whole bunch of sun gods up there at the top. I wouldn't mind getting some more, like another temple down here. Oh, wait a second. I think that... Um, yeah, so look, you can build all the way in this far, so we're going to try this. We're just going to try something. I want to see if we can do another sun god right next uh, right next to this one without it consuming it. So we're going to go here. We're going to build a ninja right there just so that that's in range. And we're going to go left, and we're going to keep on building eco once again until we get up to that 100,000. We're going to see if we can get two sun gods down there uh, or two temple of the sun gods down there because... That's going to be pretty ridiculous. That is going to be epic, epic, epic. Sabotage supply line right there. One, two, three, four. We're just going to use all of those uh, missiles. Nice. It's that same guy uh, continuing to uh, invite me even though it says that I'm in the middle of a battle. So I appreciate that. But we're holding off really well. We haven't even filled up. We filled up like nothing of the screen. Like absolutely nothing is filled up on our screen. Uh, we have so much room to put down more uh, technological terrors and just absolutely crush it right here. Uh, let's go. We're going to use two of those technological terrors so you guys can see what it looks like for those of you that have never used it before. But right here, we're going to get another Temple of the Sun God. Hopefully, it doesn't consume the other one. Let's test it out. Come on. Nice. It didn't consume it. Look at that. We got two of them down there. <laughs> That's ridiculous. It looks so sick. Oh, it looks so sick. Can we fit two right in front of each other here or not? No, we're just going to do... Well, oh, shoot. I didn't mean to do that. We're going to sell him for a lot less than what he's worth. Fit this guy right here. Can we fit another one in front of him? No, we can't. All right. So we're going to go with this guy just being a regular uh, sun god down there. Super range, epic range. And obviously, we're not going to upgrade him. Use that sabotage supply line. And watch this. We're going to pop these two abilities. One. Oh, dang it. Two. You can see what it did right there. I kind of messed up. I did that one too early. Um, but we're holding off really, really well. He's building up his wizards. He's got his sun god uh, up there at the top of the map. We're at almost 12,000 eco, guys. You know what? Let's be crazy. Let's see if we can get to 20,000 eco in this video. I'm just going to hold it down. I'm just going to boost. Uh, and we're just going to... I'm, I'm not boosting. What the heck am I saying? I'm just going to continue spamming this bad boy uh, and just spending all of our freaking money on it. 12,000 eco right now with 88... 88 freaking dollars. We're in two. We're going to use both of those. And now let's get some more uh, technological terrors over here. We can look at this. We're like, we're just going to build them practically non stop. Uh, one, two, three, four, one, two. And I think we might be able to fit one more. Can we fit? 
Oh, why can't we fit more back there? That sucks so bad. Let's build one right up here in the top corner. Yep, one, two, three, technological terror, boom, boom. And now we're holding all those off. The only thing is I don't know where the abilities are. Like, that sucks so bad because um, it's only really going to work once the whole screen is full. Sabotage apply line, one, two, three, four. Let's use all those missiles, just get them down to Moab's. Uh, and hold off. I can't believe this guy didn't get a boat on this map. I mean, I guess it is only worth five towers, so that kind of makes sense, but um, these five towers do work throughout, and they definitely help hold off towards the beginning of the map. So we're still going for it, guys. We're almost at 13,000 eco. And remember, we're getting a lot more because of the village. Shoot, let's do that. Let's build up another village um, and upgrade this thing all the way over here just like this and now let's see if we get even more oh no we still only get 4.3 that sucks come on that's stupid you know that's dumb don't tell me it's not dumb you know that it is one two robo monkey technological terror right there let's build another one right here next to him one two three four one two yep 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 we're fitting so much stuff down here we're going to continue sending our eco gosh that really sucks i thought that it would be like a ridiculous amount more money but it's not do whites come out fast let's see how fast the whites go out no, so they go out pretty slow. So pinks is definitely the way to go. Sabotage supply line right here. One, two, three, four, five. Pop all of those. We just popped almost all those ZOMGs. There was one left, and then we just did work on it. Does this guy not have epic range yet? No, he doesn't. Wow, that was dumb of me. Um, so now he's got epic range. He can actually do something. The map looks crazy over here. So much is going on. Round 55. We're at 13.5 thousand eco almost. Absolutely crushing it. Holding everything off. Uh, we're about to get to 13.5 right here. No problem. No problem whatsoever, guys. Uh, I wouldn't mind having another Sun God, but I don't really think that's possible at this point in time. I wonder if Sun Gods can consume Sun Gods. You know what I mean? Like, I could upgrade this to a Sun God right now, and I think that it would definitely consume... Yeah, it would. We're not doing it. We're not upgrading it. It would 100% consume everything else around it. One, two, use both of those, and look at all the damage that just did. They just crushed that because almost all those ZMGs had a lot of damage done to them, so they were able to take it out. Round 57 right here, guys, with so much money to spare. We need to start building some more tower. Can I really, really, really? Come on. All right. Oh, nice. We can fit this guy right here. Robo, technological, there we go. And uh, can we fit another one? Nice. Look at all these technological terrors that we have. It's ridiculous. Can we build any, right? Yes, I saw a spot. Where was it? Where was that, right? Where is it? I keep seeing it. Row, right? Okay, is this a joke? Right there. Oh my gosh, that took way too long. Nice, I think we can fit two down in here. Yes. <laughs> Look at that, they're like hidden. Keep on rolling here. We are, oh my gosh, we are doing work. We are holding off so well. He's got two Temple of the Sun Gods. Guys, we're just going to spam our eco now because I think we've got a good enough defense. One, two, three, four, five. They just did work. We've got a good enough defense that I really just want to get to 20,000 eco. Maybe even higher if we can. It's going to be absolutely ridiculous getting that much eco. Uh, even though, oh no, what? It's plugged in. Why, am I, why is there a low battery? Don't tell me there's a low battery. I know that it's plugged in. Guys, the cord is plugged in right now. Whoo, if this thing dies, if this thing dies, I am going to be so freaking stressed out sabotage let's use all these boom look at that i didn't even need to use them all but i did <laughs> um oh my gosh it'll it'll warm me again if it gets down to five percent but my ipad is getting pretty hot right now uh because of everything that's going on on the screen it is crazy he looks like he's struggling a little bit over there with everything that's coming in because we can slow things down with sabotage supply line but i think that it's going to be fine are they making the final turn it looked like no they weren't I thought they were making the final turnover on his side. So we're going to build some more. Um, let's build some more sun gods over here just because I like the way that they look. And I know that they aren't going to go fully upgraded, but they look pretty sweet. And I think that they do a good amount of damage. So we're going to go with all these sun gods over here. Look at all these things. They're crushing it. Come on. Yeah, baby. Sun gods galore. So many sun gods. Oh, come on. Don't tell me that I can't fit right there. Right there. Nice. More sun gods with epic range. Just absolutely crushing it. The epicness is real right now over on this side of the map. We've got so much room up top to build more um, to build more sun gods too or to build more super monkeys and just crush. Have I, did I upgrade this thing all the way? I did upgrade it all the way. <laughs> so crazy. We're, we're crushing it right now. Once these things uh, get towards the center, we're just going to pop all these abilities. Watch this. Ready and pop them all. 
and so many of them weren't in range. One, two, three, four, five. Pop all of those. Holding off really, really well. Hey, look at all he's built. Whoa, three. Oh no! Come on, stop it. No, there's, there is not. My battery is not low. It is charging. This is using up so much battery life, guys, that it's making my iPad freak out right now. We're almost at 16,000 eco. Absolutely crushing it. Can we fit another sun god over here? No, we can't. Uh, or another super monkey. We can't. We can't. All right, so let's start building some balloon jitsu ninjas back up in here because I know that they'll fit. Uh, they aren't going to make that big of a difference, obviously, but we're just going to build them to fill everything in over here. Fill it all in. Get everything rolling. Uh, 15,000 eco still. Uh, maybe You know what? No, I think I might go non-stop with the eco guys because I don't want him to end up losing and us not be able to get it. So we're going to grind it out. Look at how much money we have. Look at how much money we have. This is ridiculous. Sabotage supply line. Boost some of these things. Pop everything. Look at that. My map is clear. My map is practically clear right now. Absolutely ridiculous. 16,000 eco. Let's get up to 20. Let's just do it. Just We're just going to do it just to do it. Like legit. That's the only reason why we're doing it is just to be like, holy crap, look at all of the eco that we have. Uh, going to be ridiculous. We're going after it. We're going after it right now. I'm just going to use, uh, I'm going to wait to use my first strike abilities because once all those take a little bit of damage, we can just pop them and take them out without a problem. Uh, with a couple of the first strike abilities. So $316,000 to use, guys. We're 30 minutes into this match. All he's got, look at this, all that he has is three uh, Temple of the Sun Gods, which is ridiculous. Use a Sabotage Supply Line right there. I didn't even need to use my first strike abilities. They're starting to go around on his side, round 63, guys. Uh, craziness, absolute craziness. He isn't sending any sorts of eco because... Uh, you can see that none of my ninjas are shooting up there at the top of the map. Um, we're just gonna hold off. I'm not. I'm. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna take my finger off of my right hand off of the off of the eco until we get up to twenty thousand. We use sabotage supply line with the left hand, and uh, once these ZOMGs start taking some damage, we'll just go ahead and use our first strike abilities. All five of them going right there, taking everything out. He's struggling a little bit. Those ZOMGs are about halfway through the map. And there's three of them, but he's doing an okay amount of work. I wonder if that'd be pretty cool if with the Sun God, if when you consumed it, you could still use the abilities of the towers uh, that you consumed. So in just a little bit, guys, we are going to have $500,000 that we can't do anything with. We can do jack squat with our $500. I might build a uh, another Sun God up in the top corner uh, as well just to do some work. Do all of these guys have epic range? Yeah, they do. Wow. So all of those super monkeys have epic range. We are almost at 18,000, guys. We've got to hold it off. I'm going to use all these abilities. Woo! Popping all those. And then one, two uh, with the first strike abilities. Nothing. Nothing on our screen whatsoever. <laughs> Absolutely ridiculous. Round 65. And uh, we're going for it, guys. we got to get this 20,000 eco. My forearm is starting to hurt from spamming this so much. But... I think we should get it before he goes down. I definitely think our defense is a little bit better than his, but either way, Dark Clasher, epic round, dude. If you're watching, comment down below. Guys, if y'all are still here this late into the video, hashtag epic late game, hashtag epic late viewer, hashtag true malt fan. You don't have to do them all in one, but um, my true fans, the people that really, really enjoy my videos are the ones that stay late, and I love you guys. I appreciate that because... The fact that y'all invest that much time just to watch one of my videos honestly blows my mind. Like, I can't believe it. It makes me so happy that I have fans like you guys that watch as late as you do, that watch as long as you do. Um, it's ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous. Guys, we're, we might even get up to a million dollars that we can't spend. A million dollars. That's absolutely absurd. Almost to that 20,000 eco that we want to get here. Uh, and look at all the room on his side. He's holding off with all of that. That's crazy. His, just his sun gods are holding off. Wow. Three sun gods over there are holding off, or three temple of the sun gods are holding off. That's pretty crazy. Here we go. Let's see if we can stop right at the, uh, we're going to try and stop right at 20,000 eco and just leave it there because I have so much money that I don't need anymore. Use the sabotage supply line right there. Let's go ahead and pop all these abilities. You're going to see the, our side go crazy. Pop all these. Boom. Look at that. What's up? All right. So we're almost there. 199. We're working our way up. 1940, 1950, 1970, 80. Once we get into the 90s, now we're going to go down to, oh no, it's $1.2. Crap. I don't want to spend $1.2. Yes, 20,000 exactly. Dope. All right.